you, President. My question is for the Minister for Government Services, Minister Williams in the other place. <clears throat> Recent reports that this government is investigating the potential privatisation of births, deaths and marriages of Victoria are deeply alarming. These records hold some of our most essential personal information. They show us we exist, when we pass away, if we have children and if we marry. The, pre the preservation of these records is essential. There are serious consequences of any potential privatisation, regardless of whether it will be called a joint public-private partnership. It will impact privacy, costs and service delivery. Public services should remain in public hands. If a government is not obligated to protect the records of its citizens, what obligations does it have? So my question is, will the minister advocate to, in, uh, advocate to ensure that births, deaths and marriages Victoria will, be, will not be privatised in any way under this government? Minister. Uh, thank you, President, and I thank uh, Ms Payne for her question. And um, as she has correctly identified, this is a matter for the Minister for uh, Government Services, but I can certainly provide some information in relation to confirming that Victoria's births, deaths and marriages service will not be privatised. Um, but given, um, given, given, the, um, uh, given the importance of this service, we're certainly looking to improve the quality of the government services. I think particularly lots of questions in this, in this chamber over previous years, particularly when I was responsible about, about concerns about the adequacy of the service and there has been an acknowledgement in government that we need to have that improved and uh, that is certainly, that is certainly a um, endeavour from, um, on behalf of Mrs, uh, Minister Williams, um, but she will provide further detail for you, but I can certainly confirm that there is no privatisation on the books for BDM. Ms Payne, supplementary. Thank you, President, and I thank the attorney for passing the question on and for providing some, uh, some response there. By way of supplementary, this proposal would give other enterprises direct access to some of our most sensitive personal data. So I ask, what is this government planning to do to protect the data stored by births, deaths and marriages, Victoria? Minister. Um, thank you, President. I thank Ms Payne for her supplementary question, and I do confirm the information I provided to you in... Um, in response to your first question, but um, I'm sure Minister Williams will be happy to provide much greater detail to uh, uh, respond to the issues that you have raised.